Today we talk about how to upgrade motherboard for the outdoor router. This is the EZR30 outdoor router. This is the upgrade kit. Include EZR33 motherboard, jumper cables, and screws. We're going to use these tools. Firstly, we need to take out the previous mobile modem. Then replace the whole motherboard. Remove the screws on the mobile modem. Then disconnect the SMA connectors. Now we can take out the screws on the motherboard. Unplug the PoE connector. Disconnect with other two Wi-Fi connectors. We need to switch positions for the PoE socket and Wi-Fi connector. The PoE socket might be very tight. You need to twist it hard in the anti-clockwise direction. You can use a spanner to lose the Wi-Fi connector, then take it out. And remove another Wi-Fi connector on the top side. Now, we can remove the screws on the bottom board and take it out. We need to install the new Wi-Fi connector on the top side. It has a shorter cable. Remove the plastic on the silica gel. And install the new motherboard. Install the PoE socket in the middle position. And install the Wi-Fi connector. It has a longer cable. Install the new motherboard in the case with screws.
connect the top Wi-Fi connector to the left socket. Make sure you do not bend the sockets. Another socket connects to the bottom side Wi-Fi connector. Install the new mobile modem to the modem socket. Connect the 4G antennas. The right cable goes to the right connector. and the left cable goes to the left side. PoE connects to the left port. The right port does not support PoE power. Now, we take out the SIM card slot. The first slot is the primary SIM card. The pin are face down. Then install in the SIM card slot. Let's test with PoE power. The router is powered on and the lights are up. Please refer to the label to check the functions of each socket. 